This is a cadaveric specimen with the muscles cut away at the pelvic brim. Anorectal closure involves four directional muscles. Pubococcygeus, here, sweeps around to join with its opposite number and also joining with iliococcygeus to form the levator plate. The levator plate inserts into the posterior wall of rectum. Puborectalis muscle is a vertical muscle underneath pubococcygeus and it sweeps around the rectum attaches to the pelvic brim. Conjoint longitudinal muscle of the anus joins the levator plate to the external anal sphincter and it's a vertical muscle. So here is the pubococcygeus muscle contracts forward and it steadies tensions the anterior wall of rectum. The puborectalis muscle sweeps around the rectum and contracts forward against the symphysis. The levata plate contracts backwards and it tensions the rectum in preparation for the downward rotation by the conjoint longitudinal muscle of the anus. It contracts downwards against the uterosacral ligament to rotate the rectum and close the anorectal angle and close the space. I will just orientate you with the transperineal ultrasound which is coming next. Bladder, urethra, pubic symphysis, down here, anterior and posterior wall of the vagina. Here is the anus and if you look here there's the levator plate and it attaches to the posterior wall of the rectum. There's the rectum, attaches here. And underneath that is the puborectalis muscle. You can see it here. It goes round like this. Here it is. And the puborectalis muscle, you will see when the patient strains, contracts forward at the same time as the levator plate pulls the rectum backwards. So it kinks. It, the rectum pulls down and kinks around the rect PR PRM to close the anorectal angle. The first movement I will show you, pubococcygeus contracts forward to close the urethra and tension the anterior wall of rectum. Here it is. Watch it here. It goes that way. Closes the urethra and you see it tensions the anterior wall of rectum. Okay. Next I'm going to show you the puborectalis muscle. You will see it contract and pulling forward from the back wall of the rectum and it closes the space here. I'll just show you this. There it is. There it is. It goes forward. You'll see the space close. All right. Contracts forwards from the back. All right. So next I'm going to show you the levator plate pulling downwards, LMA pulling that pulling that backwards and downwards, and it rotates the rectum around the puborectalis muscle to close it here. It happens at the same time. So let's show you that. You go backwards and downwards. And notice that this goes underneath it, it goes forward to close.